Welcome back to another video, my friends. In today's video, I thought I would take you guys through a get ready with me while I am getting ready for another Halloween party. Last weekend's Halloween party was kind of like a spur of the moment, last decision, read decision. <coughs> a read decision thing but this weekend the halloween party has been already planned we've rsvp'd so we have to get ready right now i am just eating a mediterranean bowl from panera bread and it's about like 2 30 ish but we don't have to be there until 6 30 but i'm trying to start early so that in case my hair doesn't work right then i can just throw it into a low bun and call it a day but right now i'm just gonna finish up my mediterranean bowl and then i need to wash my face and and start working on my hair because I have a feeling it might take me like two hours just to do so sit back relax and enjoy this crazy ride of getting ready finding a white blanket scarf is a lot harder than you'd expect I on Friday no Wednesday yeah on Wednesday we went to the movies with our friends and the movie theater was at the mall, the one that we went to. And I told Matthew, I was like, oh, let's just go to the mall early so that I can go and find a white blanket scarf. When I tell you, we went to every single store and ended up finding it at our very last store. We basically went to every single store. Even a store you probably wouldn't expect a blanket scarf to be at, we went there because I was, when I say I was on a mission to find a white blanket scarf, I was on a mission. Matthew at one point was like, all right, you can continue on. I'll be right behind you. And was like a mile behind me because I was over here full on booking it to the next store. And I finally found one and I was like, oh my gosh. This was so hard. I didn't even expect a white blanket scarf to be this hard to find because it's white and it's a blanket scarf. Both basic items that you would want in your fall wardrobe. But no, it was a whole lot harder than you'd expect. And I'm just grateful I freaking finally found one. So I was able to complete my outfit and I think it looks so good. I'm actually really proud of how it came out because it's not an actual costume whatsoever. Another thing why I never really dressed up for Halloween is because of the co whole costume thing. I hated the fact that I would spend like a hundred bucks on a costume and then end up never wearing it ever again. And so for a while now, I've just been looking for like costumes where i can rewear the clothing as like regular street clothes so my costume is basically all accessories that i'm able to wear again but last week i told you guys or in last week's video i told you guys matt and i are gonna be anakin and padme and this halloween party there's gonna be a halloween costume contest there's like one for a guy one for a female one for a couple the worst the best the funniest i believe so i told matt we can try to win if he really wants to so i am gonna go all out like i'm full on doing her like snake looking hairdo i'm gonna try and best to win for him all right skincare is done now we gotta go and do this <laughs> Okay, so basically, let me adjust you guys. So basically for my hair, I'm gonna do a low ponytail and then use these flower wires. The person that I watched, she used something that you could like, hey, what you doing? She used something that you could basically like trim to the right size of your hair, but I couldn't find that. So we're just gonna work with that and find a way to like wrap my excess hair around it a second time in a sense so that looks like a pretty good middle part for me some underneath the
Say hi. Say hi, video. Okay. Okay. I think this is the best it's gonna get. That I didn't like slick back ponytails are so hard. If there are any bumps, I think my hair will pretty much cover it. But all in all, this is the best it's gonna get, and I'm gonna have to roll with it. So I'm gonna go put my shirt on before we start this hair. <laughs> Yes, idiots! <laughs> Bobby pins. Yeah. Is the sky blue? Ah. I'm llama. So basically, now what you do is you literally are just gonna take a piece and like. Okay, so you might need a bobby pin right there. <laughs> <laughs> Where? Oh, Move your finger! You should be Cindy Lou! And now you're just gonna bend the pieces. <laughs> Literally, it doesn't even matter how they go. Uh, oh, that looks good. Yeah. Oh, you can't say that. I know. Sex to be you. <laughs> you can go horizontal. <laughs> Wingos. <laughs> Harry Potter. Okay. Is the Bobby <laughs> product it wasn't hard honestly but it was pretty challenging at the same time but i like how it came out this is what it looks like i don't know if you guys can see it hopefully i'm angling it in the camera but the only problem i'm having with it is the flyaways but i think i will do because at the same time is that she is fighting so flyaways are gonna be a thing so well i'll just live with it now i just need to do my makeup gonna start with some with some blush and contour and then maybe some contour on my eyes mascara lip liner and some lip gloss and i think that's it so i'll catch back up with you guys when i'm like changing or doing something else this is my makeup it's done and now i'm gonna get changed i just have i'm looking at my mirror but i just have lip liner on i don't think i'm gonna put on any lip gloss actually maybe just bring the lip liner and chapstick with me and then just touch up maybe throughout the night but this is the final look it's very simple very not a lot but i think this is something i don't know i've never really seen star wars also by the way you guys are on a tripod and i'm using my phone to vlog right now because i didn't charge my battery camera so it's charging right now and i want to save up the battery so that when i get to the party i can still vlog there but this is the final face look and now i'm gonna get changed but i can do a little ootd once i'm done final look i still have to put on my belt but my sister is punching in more holes but so the shirt is from uptown cheap steak the belt is also from uptown cheap steak the leggings are from Amazon. The shoes are from Forever 21. And then the blanket scarf is from H&M. And the hair is from my sister. And the makeup is from me. The earrings. The first ones are actually ones I made. And then the rest are yada yada. I've said in other videos. And then I do have a little blaster and maybe black duct tape. 
I don't know. But I have a blaster that we might be able to get to use. It's now 5.56. We just got in the car and we're on our way to the Halloween party. This is Matthew as Anakin. Me as Padme. I'm actually like so obsessed with this outfit. I think it came out really good, especially the hair. The hair is a bit messy, but take it as if I just finished fighting someone. <laughs> so we're on our way to the party. So I'll see you when we get there. It's not crazy at all, but I'm so tired, like so freaking tired. I can't function right now, but we're here at work. I get off at two, so hopefully it's a quick day and I'll see you guys when I get off. Hopefully I don't fall asleep. <laughs> I'm back from work. It's currently 5.25 and we just got back from Target because I got some cat ears to wear tonight and <laughs> apparently kids are starting to trick or treat right now. I thought it was like 6.30. I mean, it is on a Monday this year, but still I thought it was 6.30. So I'm gonna rush a little bit to get ready. I'm just gonna do a little bit of some cat makeup and call it a day. Cause I still wanna be festive, but I don't wanna like wear too much. I did not get any sleep last night. I was waking up every single hour because I started my period the other night. And normally whenever I'm on my period, I cannot go to sleep or I have a hard time sleeping. This is the final look. It literally took me like five minutes to do. And I'm just gonna put these pink little ones in my hair like that. But I gotta cut off the little wires. So let's go cut them off and let's go start our fire and pass out some candy. <laughs> There we go, it's going! 
catch, little baby. Catch, 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 catch. Hi. Hi. My makeup messed up? Nope. Still looks good. If no kids come, I will be the trick or treater. Yeah, it's almost six o'clock and no one has come yet. Maybe trick or treating doesn't start until six. See, it just varies around here. Like, I at least had kids come at five. Maybe it just depends on like what day it falls. But I think normally it's like six to nine. Is it hot? It's hot. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, I broke it. <laughs> okay. So far, I've eaten every single piece of candy. This is my pile of candy trash. <laughs> oh, can't even see anything. We have been struggling with this fire for quite some time now. <laughs> It's a whole 48 minutes after we started this, and this is all we've got. This is all we've had. Okay, smoke it. Well, Halloween 2022 is over. Trigger treating was like two hours, so really short. I I feel like when I was a kid, trigger treating was just so. Oh, should not put that on my top. I feel like trick or treating was like three hours. I, I always thought it was like from six to nine, but I guess time has changed and it's only like six to, to eight now, but trick or treating is over. Halloween is over. It is now 8.41. I need to go wash my face off. I need to go shower, get the fire smell off of me and get ready for work again tomorrow. So I'm gonna close out this video here. I hope you guys had a safe and fun Halloween. I I definitely did. A lot of no-nos and a lot of yay-yays, but <laughs> other than that, I had a whole lot of fun. I was safe, always made sure I had a designated drivers. Yeah, I hope you guys had a fun and safe Halloween and I will see you guys next week. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because it really supports my channel. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Time.